Good morning, everybody. Good morning from Barcelona, from Spain. My name is Patricia Curti. Some of you already know me. I am the founder of Gallery of Ideas, and this is Think Fast and Speak Smart public speaking exercises today for you to practice your fluency uh, when you speak in public. This is also part of a podcast and a YouTube channel where we upload it every week your score so you can track the progress right that you're having every week i wanted to welcome my beautiful eragani she's going to be helping me today please eragani introduce yourself hello Patricia. good evening from sri lanka hello i'm erangani i'm from sri lanka i'm a teacher uh, so i'm interested in this game uh, i i took part in this game last week or so but i lost the game because i could be able to uh, give only uh, 19 words mm, but this is really interesting so let's start okay thank you yes that's that was an impressive uh, you you were the winner with 23 words per minute the week previous in december right and then last week you had a difficult words which one was it the letter l or letter in patricia n n that's right the letter n for nothing yeah that's a difficult one anyway that is not really an easy letter if you think about it all the letters are have the complexities when you are not trained to find the words easily in your brain and and just put it out and express it out loud right so i wanted to invite everybody to join us uh, just raise your hand and come to the stage if this is your first time do not be afraid uh, it's not going to be anything that you're going to feel embarrassed or um, it's just really for you to understand how fast you can access the words in your brain remember the fluency test the one that we're doing today is the phonemic fluency fluency test it's not the semantic fluency test and i explained the difference between them the phonemic fluency test is basically you will have one minute to find as many words as you can in your brain with a designated letter that i'm going to give it to you right that's the phonemic fluency test. And the quickest you can find the words in your brain, the, the quickest, the easier is going to be for you to formulate sentences and to express yourself uh, verbally. That's the whole idea for this exercise. And that's an exercise that everybody should practice on a weekly basis. All right. I'm attaching also, I'm pinned at the top, uh, one of the videos of my YouTube channel where I have this test uh, there for you to practice and every time you have a little bit of time you can go to this video and you can follow the instructions there okay and uh, make sure you just write it down on your you record yourself so you can write it down how many words you said in that minute and that's pretty much it but this is a more exciting here to do the exercise together with a live audience it's always very exciting to do that uh, let me just finish it finishing by saying with regards the semantic fluency test uh, this one, it's with regards categories. So if I give you a category, for example, countries in the world, and you have to find as many words as you can, as many countries uh, that you can find in your brain within 60 minutes. So that's a different test. We're not going to be doing this one today. We're going to be mainly concentrating on the phonemic fluency test, which is the one that we um, we do with the letters, right? Uh, so my my uh, welcome to everybody here. If you are new, make sure to join on, on the stage. If you've been with us before, uh, don't lose the opportunity to join us as well. Uh, Iragani, if you can help me to bring everybody up. Uh, we have also Jivan. Let me make him a moderator because mm -hmm. he's, he's training as a moderator with us at Gallery of Ideas. So welcome, my dear. And welcome everybody. Try to uh, to participate and make sure you don't feel shy. Nobody's going to be judging you or anything. All right. So, Jivan, a quick introduction from your side to everybody, please. Uh, uh, hello, Patricia. Hello, everyone. Uh, good evening from uh, Nepal. Hello, Patricia. I, I just recently arrived right now, and uh, I didn't hear. Could you repeat again? I'm really sorry for to see again. So, Jivan. 
I, I will also ask you to help me to bring the people uh, who would like to join us on this exercise yes. to the stage so we can get started, okay? Yeah, yes, sure, Patricia. So we invite everybody. And we're gonna, this session is going to be about 60 minutes. So, so who is our first speaker? Pa Pagia. Pagia, are you there? Yeah. Is that? Hello. Hello, hello. Welcome. How are you? I'm fine. What about you? I'm doing great. Thank you so much for joining us. Is this your first time here? Uh, no, no, it's my second time. Oh. Uh, yeah. But yeah. did you participate? Did you join uh, and do the exercise? Uh, no, it wasn't the same exercise. Like it was just talking for five minutes with the uh, with the moderators. All oh, right, all right. It was a different room. Is the the one that we have that is always open, the twenty four seven room. Yeah, right? yeah the twenty four seven. Yeah. All right, Pajia. So the, um, please introduce yourself and then we can get started with the exercise uh, and I'm going to give you a letter for you to get started, okay? Just give us a quick introduction so everybody here can find out more about you. Go ahead. Uh, yeah, so uh, I'm Prajwal Ankhade. I am from India. The Pajia is my nickname. That is what my friends call me. Uh, I am actually, I have uh, currently like completed my graduation in mechanical engineering and like I would like to pursue my MBA for the in my studies. Uh, some of my hobbies are dancing, playing cricket and various others. Right now I am I have my interview scheduled in the next month. That's why I am here. So that I can uh, practice my English properly and have a command on it like so that I can properly communicate while in the interview. Fantastic. All right. So are you ready for this exercise? Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay. So, Pajia, it's a fluency test where I'm going to give you a designated letter, which is the letter of your name and the letter of my name, the letter P, okay, for yeah. Patricia and for Pajia. Uh, so within 60 seconds, uh, you're going to have to say as many words as you can um, using this letter, okay? okay? All right, so let me time okay, you, and then when I tell you... Spell them? Or like, I'm sorry? Just, do I have to spell any of them, or like just uh, say any of the words, any names? Just the words that comes to you, that you can find, so starting with the letter P. Uh, and, and say as fast as you can, okay? So um, I'm going to time you. Let me give you, let me reset the clock. And your time starts in three, two, one, go. Mm, okay. Uh... Uh, poet, pet, uh, pet, poet, pet, uh, poem, poet, like whatever, pinnacle, parents, um, paragon, pentagon, peace, peach, ears, People, perfect, perform, perfume, preserve, perceive, persistent, permission, permissible. And your time is up. Your time is up. Okay, let me just stop the clock. From my count, I think you did absolutely amazing. I've counted 20 words per minute. Eragani and Jivan, how much did you count? Uh, I counted 18 words per minute, Patricia. Okay, and uh, Jivan? Uh, Patricia, I'm really sorry. My network connection is getting a little slow. So I just uh, arranged my network. Uh, uh, I, you I missed the count. Uh, yeah, yeah, I missed oh, the count. Okay. I'm really sorry for that. No, no, it's okay. All right, so um, I did yeah. get some of the the words um, that are, maybe there was some repeating there. So I'm yeah, going to give you... The, at the start, yeah. I had two words repeated. Yes, that's right. So I think uh, Erangani counted right. So it's 18 words per minute, which is that's absolutely awesome. amazing. Uh, if you think about um, the average for this test, someone 
that are articulate and, and well-versed, they will score usually between 25 to 35 words per minute, okay. right? And a professional speaker usually uh, someone that has like to speak in public all the time, they usually go above 35 words per minute. Now, oh. uh, most people, uh, when they start and the first time they do this test, they score between 10 to 12 words per minute. So you did absolutely amazing. Congratulations. I will add your you. score to the podcast and to the YouTube channel. Make sure you follow the channel so you can see when the video is published, okay? The channel is attached at the top, all right? Okay, so let's move on to the next speaker. Let me just see here who is next in the PTR order. Hold on Thank a second. You. Thank you. Stay with us so you can see who is going to win because we also have the winner of the every episode that we do. And the, the winner gets a shout out on social media, uh, shorts on YouTube, uh, stories on Instagram. So whoever scores the, the biggest um, number today will get this opportunity. Okay, so stay with us until the end. All right, uh, Kanshana, you are next. Hello, Kanshana. Please introduce yourself to everybody here, Kanshana. Okay, thank you, Patricia. Hello, everyone. My name is Kanshana. I am speaking from Thailand. Wonderful. Kanshana, good to have you. So, Kanshana, have you ever done this exercise before? No, but no? I just in the listening when you uh, done your exercise that I just listening. All right. So, let's see. Okay, Kanshana. So, this exercise, it's not about how uh, good you speak English. You know, it's not about if you are a native English speaker, you're going to score really high because you control the language. It's not about that, right? It's about how fast you can access the information in your brain. It's a different story. Many English, native English speakers, they don't really score really high because it's not about knowing and having the vocabulary, knowing the language and having the vocabulary. It's about really the speed that you have in accessing the information and then verbalizing, okay? So anyone can score high on this if your brain is wired this way. We have a hot mic somewhere, hot mic. Oh, have a word, please. When you join the stages, just make sure you mute yourself so we don't get um, the... The, the disturbance, okay, on the audio quality. All right, so let's get started with Kanshana. Let me write it down your name, Kanshana, and give you the letter. I'm going to give you the letter B, okay, for Brazil, Kanshana, letter B. Okay, so okay. Try okay. to think of as many words as you can with the letter B. Okay, okay. B. And B, okay, okay. And, let's... and your time it starts in, hold on, let me reset the clock. Uh, Eragani, if you can help me to count, let's go, Giovanni also. And three, two, one, go. Bet. Better. Best. Begin. Before. Be careful. Believe. Um, uh, brain. But. Bread. Beat. Beat. Buy. Beg. Become, became, bake, bakery, bet, um, sorry, <sighs> better. Uh, you're doing great. Go, Kashana, go. You're doing great. Oh, uh, bought, bought, borrow, but. Bring between um. and your time is up, Kanshana. <laughs> Thank you, Kanshana. <laughs> How did you feel, my friends? How did you feel? I'm so excited. <laughs> I know, oh I know that. I know that. Uh, I, I'm, you I'm did so amazing, Kanshana. <laughs> I'm, I'm so happy that I joined wow. your room. Thank Do you, you know? So You're welcome. Do you know how many words? Can you guess how many words you, you spoke in one minute? How many words per minute? I don't can remember. Can you guess? I don't remember. Because so, I'm so nervous and excited so much. 
<laughs> yes, you can't you can't think about it. Of course, this has to be recorded or somebody has to count it for you. So luckily, we did the count for you. Let me just match with my moderators. Eragani, how many words did you count from your end? Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I got 24. One, I didn't uh, hear the one word properly. I got okay. 24. But, All right. And Jivan, did you you were able to count or you still have connection issues? Yeah, yeah, yes, 25, Congener, Patricia. Yeah. 25? Yeah, All right. 25. So, yeah, 25, I'm, yeah. okay, I'm going to have to say that we're going to have to narrow down a little bit because there were some words that Kanchana said, it was repeat, okay, and some of the words was just a variation of the same uh, word. For example, um, Kanchana said, became and become. Right, so it's the same words. We're not going to count as two. We're going to count it as one, and then there were some other words that she uh, repeats. So the final count is twenty-two words per minute, which is absolutely amazing, Kanshana. Considering that you've been studying English for not so long ago, right, and um, you are uh, just like very close to the average speaker. Like that are well versed, that is articulate, someone that can express the ideas uh, easily in English. So that remember, the average is between twenty five to thirty five words per minute, and you scored twenty two. So well done, my dear Kanshana. Well done, congratulations. And you are the winner so far because previously our friends just scored eighteen words per minute. So if nobody scores more than twenty two words per minute, Kanshana, you will be the winner of today's episode. Woohoo! <laughs> Thank you, Patricia, because of your room uh, that I have a good chance to practice speaking and practice listening. Thank you so much, Patricia. You're welcome. You'll keep practicing. Practice makes progress. Remember. All right. So let's move on to Idrani. Idrani, welcome back. And uh, please introduce yourself and uh, tell us if about the previous experiences that you had. Hello, Patricia. Yes, uh, I had done this exercise before also in your room. And uh, I also do this with my friends uh, in various other rooms. And uh, like a uh, few of our uh, friends, we just gather and we try to do this together. Like it quite helps uh, a little bit uh, to improve. Uh, so this is and, and, and I enjoy a lot whenever I do this. Wonderful. Do you remember? Can you share your score last time that we had it in the in our YouTube channel? Uh, Do you I remember? I, guess, uh, I can't remember, but uh, on an average, whenever I try, uh, it's uh, thirteen to fourteen. Uh, maybe one time I did sixteen. Maybe it is like All average right. thirteen All to forty right. fourteen words. I come up every time. Yes. And uh, do you remember which letter was the most difficult for you? Um, no, I can't uh, remember right now. But, uh, but I tried uh, maybe with L or N uh, last time when I was uh, in your room. L and N. Okay, so we're not going to give you that today. We're going to give you a different one so you can practice with different letters. All right, so let's uh -huh. go with the letter A, the first letter of the alphabet. So let me just write uh -huh. your name down. Hold on a second. So I have Kanshana. And please, everybody, remember that all... The, uh, the participants will have their names and the final score uh, records in the YouTube channel and also the podcast so you can track your progress every week, okay? So Indran, Indrani, uh, let me add yours and reset the clock with the letter A. Your time starts in three, two, one, go. Mm -hmm. uh, Apple, Amplify, Allergy, Advocate, uh, ap uh, apply, application, um, abuse, abundant, amusement, um, um, uh, uh, ab abduct, um, abortion, Uh, abortion, ab, uh, uh, a, a, uh, 
Oh my god, I can't come up with words. Go, go, go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, I can tie this up. <laughs> oh, you're Johnny. So, you, let's see how, how many words. Eragani, how many words did you count? I got 11 words, Patricia. Oh, oh right. Okay, and Shivan? Yeah, Patricia, that's 11. That's exactly. 11, 11, right? Okay, we all got the same number, 11, me too. So 11 words per minute. Uh, again, remember, uh, it's not something that you do three sessions or four sessions and then suddenly you start being super quick and you are able to access fast faster than before. It's a matter of practicing and stretching that muscle, right? So right now, um, by doing this exercise, if you do it every week, you will notice the progress in Drani. And also, uh, I attach the video where I have the the whole explanation about this test and also another test on this uh, YouTube channel video that it's attached and pinned to the top. So watch this video every week when there is a part there with the clock that can track you, that can help you. So if you do it once a week or twice a week, you will notice that you're going to get better. Mm -hmm. And every Saturday, come back to the room and then practice in front of everybody because that adds an extra layer of stress as well when you are in front of a live audience, of course. But well done. Keep practicing, my dear. And um, yes, Thank you so much. Uh, yes. Uh, and I am all, I am following you in YouTube also. And uh, because I'm a little bit interested in public speaking and your video is on that. So uh, just, uh, I learned a few things from there. Oh, wonderful. Yes. I publish a lot of content, free resources for everybody yeah, on that channel. Yes, recently, recently you have published a video on, on leadership. Like it's it was a podcast kind of. So, an interview, yes. Yeah, yeah, an interview, yes, 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 an interview, yes. I have yes. watched that also. Oh, wonderful. That that interview is with a very uh, fantastic speaker, Tim Leverage. He's from um, yes, Germany. Yes. yes, very interesting. Uh, there's a lot of nuggets of wisdom there. And also, I will be bringing back this year, uh, 2022, uh, some of the the episodes of storytelling. Uh, that is a, a part on the channel that is all about storytelling and short stories with moral, right? Which this kind of stories, they help us to craft our presentations, introduce some storytelling and bring uh, some color to the presentations. So uh, I'm, I'm going to let you know. Anyway, it's going to be announced on the channels. But for now, you can access uh, for the verbal fluency test, which is the one that we're doing today. You can access this video that is, just save this video on your list of favorite videos. And then every time you need to do the exercise, you just go back there, all right? Mm -hmm. Thank okay, you. my dear, Thank you so much. stay with us to see who is gonna win today, if you are curious to find out the winner. We have another 30 minutes. I hope to get as many people as possible here on stage. Next is Matur. Matur, are you there? Yes, I'm very much here, Patricia. Oh, Happy New Year, my friends. How are you? Oh, oh, yes, thank you. I'm doing extremely fine. Yes, excited am I here. Oh, wonderful. I haven't seen you for a while, but um, I, I believe we are all busy with different things, right? So and it's hard to find the right time to meet online, especially um, on Clubhouse. But Matur, you understood the exercise, right? Yes, I understood, yes. Okay, so before we begin... Uh, please give a quick introduction to everybody here so they can know a little bit more about you. And then we go. Yes, yes I'm Matu Sridhar. I'm from the southern part of India in a place called Chennai. I am a retired a person. I worked in the financial services industry for about 30 years. And then I got into content writing. Content writing exposed me to teaching and training. And now I'm trying to explore possibilities if I can train and teach people. That's about me in short. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Matur, for the quick introduction. Now, let's get you started with the letter S for Sunday. Yes? Okay. All right. So let me write down your name, Matur, and let's see how many words you can access in your brain within 60 seconds. So let me the timer and the clock resetting, and the time starts in three, two, one. Okay. Go. Success. Success. Scribble. Script, scriptures, scrutinize, subtle, shelter, sheriff, 
شاين شفت شل شلف شوت شولدر شاور شوتيج شوت كمين شوت اند شوت سلولي شو سمول سماش سموك سموت سمجل سماك سبلنتر سبلندر سبويل سبونتينيتي سبون او ماي جودنس يا تايم از اب يا تايم از اب That was amazing, Matu. Kanshana, you... Oh, Kanshana, I'm so sorry. You just lost. <laughs> Because Matu scored more than 30 words per minute. On my count, 31 exactly. I don't know, Aragani and Jivan, uh, how many words did you count? Yeah, exactly 31. 31, 31, Patricia. 31 for you as well. And you, Jivan? Yeah. Uh, Patricia, I might be wrong, but I, some one word I just missing. The 32, I just get. You got 32. There was a, yes, a, a, yes. a repeat. That's why uh, we can't study one. But excellent. Thank you very much, guys, for helping me. And Matu, wow. I didn't know you had such a fluency. You know, it's amazing. Because it's something related to how fast you can access those words in your brain. And you are extremely fast. You are um, within almost within the professional speaker's area. Right. So well done. Uh, how did you feel? Yes, I, I felt excited. I'm just participating for the first time. But then it's a question of recollecting words that are there within you. You may have maybe knowing so many words, but to get it at the right time, it's quite difficult. You may not get it. That's and right. That's, it, yes. that's absolutely right. And, and you never did this test before, the fluency, the verbal fluency test before. Yes, I never did. But I had a technique. Never? It's your first time? Yes. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm amazed. I'm amazed. So that means you're going to come back every Saturday now, right? To keep tracking your progress. Let's see if next Saturday you are going to score more than 31 words oh, per see. minute. Yeah, let's see. And if nobody scores more than 31 words per minute today, uh, you will be the winner of today's session. But let's continue. Stay with us because we're going to go. Let's try to get um, uh, more people from the stage. We have Manish next. Manish, are you there? Uh, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. A very good afternoon. Good afternoon, Manish. Please introduce yourself to us. Yeah, this is Manish from the Northern Himalayas. My state is Uttarakhand and my neighbor country is Nepal. Now I'm pursuing a Bachelor of Technology in Computer Science and it's my last year. Very good introduction, Manish. Well done within 30 seconds. Okay, so Manish, the letter for you is the letter M, the letter for your name. So think as many words as you can with the letter M without, uh, within 60 minutes. Uh, sorry, 60 uh, seconds, <laughs> not 60 minutes. <laughs> All right, so let me reset the clock and you have 60 seconds to think and say out loud all the words you can find, starting with the letter M. Okay, ready? Uh, yes, ma'am. So three, two, one, go. Uh, money, uh, making, makes, and methodology, uh, marvelous, uh, magnificent, and moral, monkey, meat, uh, uh, minister, uh, miserable, Markle, a miracle, a monument, a movement, and mystery, uh, magnesium, uh, uh, go, 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 <laughs> you're doing well, go, 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 keep going, uh, minute, ma, um, uh, monument, and, uh, <laughs> and your time is up your time is up unfortunately but you did amazing is this your first time as well manish uh yes ma'am it's my first time all right so you did amazing uh, on my count there was only one repeat uh you said there was monument twice 
but I counted 18 words per minute. Um, per minute. Aragani, how many did you count? Uh, I got 17 words per minute. All right. And Dajivan? I get 19. And that one word I see, I heard that make, making what the difference is there and different. Makes All right. Like. So I think we've got an 18. Between the 17 and 19, <laughs> we got the one 18. Remember, you can all watch again on YouTube and count again uh, later. And let me know in the comments if the if you disagree with the final count. Okay. Because sometimes it goes so fast, obviously. Um, it can be some some words that we miss or something like that. So if you count it when you listen when you watch the video and you, you count it more or less, just make a give us a comment and let us know. Because when my team is publishing this on YouTube, uh, they try to recount as well, but not all the time. So make sure you you also count when you watch it. Okay. And thank you so much for joining us, Manish. Stay with us to see uh, who is going to win today's episode. We have another. 25 minutes to continue and to close this episode today. So let me uh, move on to Riyadh. Hi, Riyadh. Are you there? Yes, ma'am. Uh, please introduce yourself, Riyadh. Welcome to the, the stage. Okay. My name is Riyadh. I'm from India, but I'm working in Kuwait uh, as a driver come operator. Actually, I'm uh, almost fresh. Uh, in English, I'm trying recently only. Uh, I think this is first time I am hearing about this kind of exercise. Uh, let me try. Okay. That's the attitude. That's the attitude, Riyadh. We have to try new things in life and see how it goes, right? Uh, and this exercise, remember, it, it can be very difficult uh, for for everybody when we start the first, especially the first time. It's not something that comes naturally to us. The speed, uh, it's something that happens with exercise and practice. So, uh, Riyadh, for you, the letter of your name as well, the letter R. So think as as, as many words as you can with the letter R within one minute. So let me reset the clock and your time. Ready? Riyadh, are you ready? Uh, ready, but you can, ma'am, can you change this letter? Because I think R is very difficult for me. <laughs> oh, you guys are amazing. You always find all the letters that I give you difficult. <laughs> Do you want to go with the letter I for Italy? It's a very difficult letter as well. You choose R or I. I give you these two options. Which one, Riyadh? So let me try R, no problem. <laughs> okay. All right. So your time starts in three, two, one, go. Oh. Red. Rowdy. Rude. Round. Rain. Eighteen seconds. Come on, come on, Riyadh, go. Risk. And the time is up, my friend. I've counted the last words, understanding that is risk, correct? So if I count risk as the last words that you said, that means seven words per minute. All right, Riyadh, remember, do not feel demotivated. This is all about practicing the speed in which I'm sure you have more vocabulary in your brain, but you're not used to access them quickly enough. All right. So that's why this exercise can help you to find that fluency. The quickest you can access the information in your brain, uh, the more fluent speaker you will become. Right. So how did you feel? Yeah. So first time experience. Uh, that's why uh, now I, I subscribe to your YouTube channel. I will try more and more times. Okay. 
yes, this video that I attached, you can, uh, you have the, the, the timer, the minutes, the explanations, the letters that I give you, everything is in the video. So it helps you to practice on your own and try to come back on Saturdays uh, to the session, which is um, in front of everybody here, a live session. It's good for you to practice in front of people. All right. So thank you so much, Riyadh. Let me move on to Bupendra. Bupendra, is that how I pronounce your name? Hello, good afternoon, ma'am. Good afternoon. Hi, Bupendra. Please introduce yourself. Yes, uh, my name is Bupendra Singh Thakur and I'm from India, northern part of India. I'm doing my study. All right. Thank you for that. And have you done the fluency test before? The verbal uh, fluency yeah, test? Yeah, With Indrani, I had done for one time. Oh, right. So that's not your first time. Okay. So do you remember which letter did you do the test? Yeah, uh, I I did with R. R. Oh, the same like Riyadh. Okay. And uh, so today I'm going to give the letter, um, the letter uh, C for car. Okay. C for car. Right. Let me just write it down. Try to think as many words as you can within 60 seconds. Are you ready? Let me reset the clock. And your time clock. And uh, the time starts in three, two, one, go. B, below, B, brand, between, beside, before, Weather Believe <laughs> Go, go, I know it's hard. I'm waiting for time up. No, don't give up. You have five seconds. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, so let me check with Eragani. How many words did you count? Uh, six words per minute, Patricia. And Jivan? Uh, I count uh, seven words, but I didn't understand the two, two things like brand and better. I didn't understand. Yes, <laughs> I, I counted seven as well. So, uh, right. So seven words per minute, Bupendra, that, uh, there is a lot of room for, for you to practice and improve the score. I'm going to write it down, all this, the final scores on the YouTube channel, as I mentioned before. Remember to just activate the bell so you can get a notification when the video is on. I will ask my team to upload this video today so you can all check. Uh, because it's uh, a lot of fun to watch it on YouTube with all the effects and everything. I know you can get also the replay here on Clubhouse, but uh, it's uh, it's fun to listen uh, with all the effects that they do. So I will try to get it up and running today, if not tomorrow. Okay. So thank you for participating, and I look forward to seeing you again next week. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, sir. Thank you. All right. Next, we have. Uh, let me just PTR. Let me just see. We have Shinka Shri, Shri, uh, Shrikar. How do I pronounce yes, your name? Shrikar. Shrikar. Uh, Shrikar, welcome. Please introduce yourself. Thank you. My, my name is Shrikar. I am from India, Karnataka. In India, Karnataka state. Okay. Is this the first time for you that you're doing the yes. verbal fluency test? Yes. All oh, right. Um, so let's see how. Are you excited? Are you nervous? <laughs> I'm nervous. I don't know English at all. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We remember it's not a competition. Uh, it's it. Nobody's going to be judging you. It's an exercise for you to get better at your fluency. And we we do count like we do recognize the person every in every episode that scores the biggest number just to you know to do a shout out on social media and celebrate but it's not a competition okay so let me give you the letter uh, d for 
divine. Okay, so let me write down your name. D for divine. Okay, Shikar. Yes. A divine dog. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me just give you the heads up. So let me reset the clock, and your time starts in three, two, one, go. Dog. Danger. Drop. Driver. Dinesh. Distance. Danger. Dish. Deliver. Del. Drink. Dance. Drawing. Dress. Door. Dinner. Documentary. Dishes. Oh, good one. <laughs> good one, documentary. Good words. Um, Iragani, how many words did you count? I counted 16 words. All right, it's the same here. And Jivan? Uh, sorry, I counted 18. Okay, there was a repeat there. Uh, so we counted 16 words per minute as the total. Well done. For the first time, Shrinkar, this is, as I said, very difficult. How did you feel? Thank you. Thank you for giving me this opportunity. I felt well. Good. Yes, you should be proud of yourself. 16 words per minute at, uh, doing the test of the phonemic verbal fluency test. It's a very good thing, very good score. So well done, well done. Okay, Shinka, remember to watch the video and count it yourself as well and keep practicing with the, the video that I've attached here today. Let me move on to Hashita and then we have 15 minutes more or less. So hopefully I can get three more people or four, let's see. Ashita, welcome back. How are you? Hello, Patricia. I'm doing fantastic. How are you? I'm doing great. Thank you so much. So, Ashita, have you done this exercise before? Um, I mean, like, this is, like, the first time I'm getting into this room and doing, like, an official one. But this is something which I play on my friends. And, you know, sometimes they ask me, like, oh, come on, just tell me some words on this letter. So... It's like something I've done like in a playful way, but not in a serious way like this, you know, like strictly having a timer and then think and then do it. Yeah. Yes, it adds a, an, another extra layer of stress. And that's where it's a big challenge, right? Yeah. Because yeah. when we are talking in public, you can't really say, uh, wait a minute, let me just, you know, <laughs> rewrite my notes. You have to go with everything you've got. So this test, when you do it in public, it's much, much more efficient for everybody. So let me give you the letter F, the letter F for France. Think of as many words as you can within 60 seconds. Okay, so let me time you. And uh, your time starts. Ready? Oh, yeah? yes, ready. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, uh, we have to say, I was born ready. <laughs> okay, yeah, ready, ready. Born oh, ready, let's ready. go. Can I, can I take the names of people? Yes, of course. Name of people, names of countries, names of places, um, anything really, any, any words okay. that you can find. The only thing is that we are doing this exercise in English, so you have to be uh, names in English, preferably. Okay. Names that we can understand in English, yeah, let's put it this way. Sure, um, when I do this exercise in Portuguese or in another language, then we have to focus on that, in words in that language, right? Uh, and before we go, actually, Hashita, please introduce yourself. I didn't, uh, sorry, I didn't ask oh, you yeah. to introduce yourself yes, to the team here. Yeah, so my name is Harshita and I'm doing my VTA computer science with specialization in artificial intelligence and machine learning right now. And apart from that, uh, I love public speaking a lot. And that's the reason I also joined as a moderator in Gallery of, uh, Gallery of Ideas like uh, two weeks ago. And then I just love the way I interacted with people and the amount of exchange in ideas and the interaction happens is immaculate. Uh, so I'm also like a podcaster, uh, IHR head in one of the companies also. 
a professional anchor and online educator where i recently opened a online academy where i'm on a mission and vision to create fearless public speakers and uh, yeah so like and the rest is in my bio <laughs> Fantastic. That was an excellent introduction. Thank you so much, Hashita. And uh, welcome to the family. You're welcome. You, if you pass the, the, the test and you are a uh, qualified moderator guy with ideas, I'm, I congratulate you and I welcome you with my open arms. Welcome to the team. Thank you so okay, much. let's go. Let's do this because I wanted to take as many people as possible as well today before we close this session. Hashita, one minute, the letter F for France. So we're setting the clock and it's starting in three, two, one, go. Okay, fuzzies are Faridabad, funny, uh, fence, float, paint, block, uh, flint, further, fantastic, freak, um, uh, fuzzy, uh, flary, um, uh, flinching, um, party, and uh, five, felt, fire, um, foot, uh, fall, pool, uh, fork, uh, fly, frog, plug, um, uh, um, a fist, a fix, a fog, frog, and uh, a feminine, females, now uh, France, um, a fill, flask, uh, a flutter, fit, um, fancy, um, fluid, uh, forums, um, uh, fighting, um, 55, uh, finale, fiancé, fickle. Uh, and your time is up, your time is up. <laughs> oh my goodness, you could stay here all day saying, how many words do you have in your brain? You could stay here all day, well done. <laughs> yeah, recollecting is so hard, oh my God. Yeah, well, it it's not that... Difficult. It's not that hard to you. You did amazing, really well. So let me see. Let me check with my co-moderators. And Ragani, how many did you count? If I'm not mistaken, I got 39. I miss some words, Patricia. I got 39. 39. Yes, the same that I counted as well. And uh, Jivan? Uh, 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 if I'm wrong, <laughs> I'm really sorry, but I count uh, 44. Oh, yes. You always count the repeats, Jivan. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. I think so. Yes, you count the repeats. And uh, to be honest, Hashita, you did it so fast that I think I the three of us, we struggle to, to count. <laughs> Thank you so much. I didn't expect that I would be doing this. Oh, my God. It was so hard to recollect, though. Yeah. <laughs> wow, amazing. So 39 is your final score. Remember, I will add the final score in the YouTube channel video that is going to be uploaded this weekend. If you, uh, when you listen to yourself again, and if you uh, disagree with the final score, just add your comments and say, hey, Patty, I counted and on my count, it's less or more uh, according to my count, because this, you, you forgot this words or whatever you wanted to comment, okay? Um, and so, so far, Hashita, you are the winner so far because you oh, passed you. Matur. Thanks Matur was the, 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 the 31 words per minute. Uh, the highest score so far, and you have 39. So let's see if we can get someone to beat Hashita. Thank you so much, my dear, and see you around you. Gallery of Ideas rooms. Sure. Thank you so much, Patricia. Thank you. Thank you. So, Shino, are you there? Yes, ma'am. How are you, Shino? I'm great, and thanks, thanks for asking. How about you? I'm doing great. Thank you for being here. So, Shino, please introduce yourself. Hi, this is Chinu. I'm from Andhra, India. I'm a student pursuing my post-graduation. And <laughs> I think I should try. It would be uh, next to impossible to crack for 40 words in a minute. <laughs> oh, yes, that's a difficult one. But hey, do not stress. It's not, a, as I said, it's not a competition. It's really for you to, to understand where you are at. Uh, and how fast you can access these words in your brain and how much more training you believe you're going to need, you know, to keep going and, and doing this. So let's, uh, let me give you a letter. Let me just write your name here and reset the clock. So the letter for you, Shino, is the letter N for no. All right, letter N. Let's see how many words you can come up with. The letter N is 60 seconds and your time starts in three, two, one, go. Nature, national, navigate, navy, uh, natural, nine, um, 
uh, 990 uh, neighbor uh, negotiate uh, negotiate <laughs> negotiate and keep going keep going yeah 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 negotiate um nail uh nail uh nail what is nephron nigeria <laughs> nephron nigeria uh natural resources natural gases um <laughs> <laughs> should make something <laughs> go 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 right. 99 99 99 90 <laughs> oh my goodness oh that's too much no 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 we cannot count that as you know but uh, oh no, my god those are different good <laughs> yeah it's, it's a unique number <laughs> you have to count right. it oh um. We can only count the existent words and not really the ones that we are making up. That's I not the one. I think ninety-nine, ninety-two, ninety-one are exist. That, yes, they do exist, but not not. They are not considered one one unique words in the in that sense uh, for this exercise. <laughs> I know they are different numbers. <laughs> yeah, I'm uh, just joking. Yeah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's it. I know, I know. All right. So on my count, I've got thirteen words per minute. Uh, Eragami and Jivan, how many did you count? Uh, I got 14. And you, Jivan? I got 14, Patricia. Patricia All right, so I believe it's 14 then because I was undecided between 14 and 13. So now you just reconfirmed 14 for me. Thank you very much. So, thank you. 14 words per minute, you need. Make sure you keep coming back every Saturday. Make sure you keep practicing. If you can, practice before next weekend. Uh, go to this video that is attached and pinned to the top of the channel. Uh, to this room here and um, do some exercise on your own and come back in a, with a live audience, all right? Okay, let's move on now to Colo. Colo, are you there? Hi, hi, Patricia. How are you? I'm good and you? I'm doing great, my dear, doing great. So please introduce yourself and let us know who a little bit more about who you are. Um, thank you. My heart is pumping. It's about to get out of the chest. <laughs> My name is Kule Faila from South Africa. I help busy executive women and mummies to lose weight, and I help them transform from unhealthy habits. I am actually a health and lifestyle coach, and I'm also part of um, a network marketing, and I do sub organic supplements. So, in a nutshell, I'm a mom of six, three of my own, and three that are. Um, from my husband so yes um i'm from south africa and i'm loving the, the this this room oh that's wonderful so welcome is this the first time you join us at gallery of ideas it is the first time and i'm so excited and never been the same <laughs> <laughs> all right so you are from south africa that means that english is your native language right <laughs> not really But it is it is uh, a language that we use mostly around yeah <laughs> in South Africa. All right, uh, so we can consider let's put it that is your first language, and that again with that being said, it doesn't mean because it's a language that it's your native or it's a language that you grew up with, it doesn't mean that you're gonna score high, right? The whole <laughs> idea yeah for this exercise it's to understand the speed that you can access information in your brain. So not everybody have. The same speed. Some people they they naturally have a little bit. They are more at ease. In some people they are not so at ease. Like when I did it the first time, this exercise. I remember back in the nineties with my mentor. He, I think I, I scored. I tell everybody twelve words per minute. And uh, since then, I've been practicing, practicing, practicing because I do not have that speed naturally with me. And uh, most people they won't sco score very high and uh, the first time. So do not worry too much if you score. Uh, a low number be below 25 uh, obviously it needs improvements the average again is between 25 to 35 words per minute and anything above 35 words per minute uh, it means that your fluency is excellent right so let's see where you are and let's see how much exercise you're going to need now yeah. Colo, i'm going to give you the letter uh, da -da 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 -da. 
I'm going to give you the letter M for mother. All right. So think as many words as you can with the letter M. And, M for uh, mother. That's right. And your time starts in three, two, one, go. Um, money, make magic, um, uh, machine, um, <laughs> um, um, morning, um, morn, um, <laughs> <laughs> Go, go, go! <laughs> yeah, go, go, go. Um, Manuela, um, how did that even come? Did I say money? <laughs> yes, three times. <laughs> go, Manuela was a good one. People's names, countries. Go, go, go. Can I say it <laughs> <laughs> I'm just repeating everything. <laughs> if we could count how many times we're laughing. <laughs> oh my goodness, you would win. <laughs> All right, Colo, next time you have to concentrate more. Uh, you're laughing too hard, you know, just by being shocked how difficult it is, right? It's not an easy thing to do. And uh, when everybody else was saying the words, I was like, I can say this, I can say this, but everything just went. <laughs> Next time I'll concentrate, but I'm loving this. I'm just, in it made my morning. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm glad. It is so true, though. When other people are doing the exercise, we somehow come up with loads of words, right? Thinking, come on, this word and this word. We're always thinking for the other people. We wanted to say, right, out loud to them. But when it's our turn, um, things get a bit complicated. <laughs> we, <Yeah>. we freeze. <laughs> All right, so I'll on my count, you. on my count, Colo, six words per minute. Uh, I will add the score. Hopefully, you can come back next weekend. And hopefully, you can practice with the video that I've done that is attached here and pinned to the channel. Okay, I'm this definitely video. Definitely coming back. I'm definitely yeah. coming back. <laughs> and try to do it yourself at home as well. The exercise, okay? And keep yeah. practicing, my dear. Keep practicing because you are on your way now. Now that you discovered this, you're gonna be. I know. I can feel it that you're gonna really challenge yourself to to beat your own score <laughs> next time. <laughs> thank you. All right, thank you. And I'm gonna get one more person, and then we're gonna have to close. Uh, I'm gonna get Seban. And then Kenneth, Safia, and Rose. I'm so sorry. We're going to have to um, get you guys next time because this session is about 60 minutes and I'm running late already for another appointment. So, Siban, last one with you. Please, quick introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Victor and um, my family name is Siban. I am from Southeast Europe. I am from a small country in Moldova. It's called Moldova. It's located between Romania and Ukraine. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. All right, Victor. So have you done this exercise before? Oh, it is my first time when I, uh, I find out about this uh, exercise. I think it is very useful uh, for practicing and for developing fluency. So I will practice uh, in future this exercise, I think. Absolutely, absolutely. And make sure um, to follow Gallery of Ideas Club here because we have so many great rooms to help you improve your public speaking skills. In fact, we have a room that is open 24-7. It never closes, it never shuts down. In this room, you can come in any time of your day or night and you will always find people there to practice your conversation in English, right? So you can oh, practice yeah. speaking. I, I, I agree, it's a great room, yeah. I, You've really been there? Oh, wonderful, yeah. wonderful. All right, so all these rooms that can help your fluency, can help your speaking skills and listening skills, very important as well. So, Victor, I'm going to give you the letter L, okay? L for London, okay? So think as many words as you can with the letter L within 60 seconds. Let me give you, let me reset the timer. And we have three, two, one, go. Lie, lay, love, lover, London, less, lesson, lecture, literature, lovable, uh, leave, lost, lose, uh, limb, 
letter last uh, letter uh, look uh, uh, lore list uh, loom leak lie and your time is up my friend <laughs> you did really well let me just confirm with Aragani which by the way Aragani and Jivan I'm gonna do yours as well I'm sorry because uh, we need to keep your score so let's do yours quickly after that and then uh, I just wanted to give a shout out to the winner of last week EB he's in the audience well done EB you were the winner last week uh, I hope you enjoyed the shout outs on social media um, and I hope you can come back and practice again next time, maybe. So now I'm going to check. Let's check uh, Victor's score. So Eragani, how many did he um, did he do on your end? Um, I got 22 words per minute. All right. The same like I did. Okay. 22 for me too. Yes, Jivan? 22? Yes, that's correct. 22. Yeah, so exactly. we have a final score. There's a great, the three of us. Uh, Victor, 22 words per minute. It's absolutely amazing for the first time. Thank so well done. well done well done keep coming back keep practicing and let's uh, get this fluency let's get everybody here uh, to become an eloquent and really well-versed speaker uh let's just finish then with Aragani. Aragani, i'm gonna give you the letter um, a this time okay so try to say as many words as you can and then we're gonna track you the progress here your time starts Aragani in three Two, one, go. And apple access x access axis uh, available apology apologizes um, Andrew availability available apart apart from another accident ancient America avoid avoiding avoided act acted actress acting actor act, accidentally abandoned an angel angelina uh, africa arab uh, arabic, arabic Almost. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, Aragani, that was amazing. Much better. This is your high score. However, uh, you did a lot of repetitions uh, and a lot of uh, variation of the same words, right? You did, for example, avoid, avoiding, avoided, right? So you can. <laughs> You got a word and then you used all the verb forms of that word that you could find. So there's a lot of repeat. Uh, I have to recount again, but I believe uh, the right score would be around 25, 26 words per minute. Uh, Jivan, did you count the same? Or what is your count on your end? Yeah, I count uh, 25. 25, yes. yes. So I believe it's 25, which is an amazing progress from your last score, the one that you won last uh, two weeks ago. Uh, that you score 23 words per minute. So well done, my dear. Well done. Well, thank you, Patricia. Thank you. How did you feel? Uh, now I'm a little bit relaxed, uh, not like the other uh, uh, terms, uh, but uh, when I sp uh, try to speak, I forget the words. Then I try to remember. Then my mind go goes blank. That's what happened to me, Patricia. Yeah, no, you're much more relaxed uh, this week. Last week you got really stressed out. Which letter was it last week that you uh, you struggled I got a bit? Letter, letter in, in. Mm, I couldn't. The letter make, M, uh, yeah. yeah, I couldn't give the word even knows. I forgot that word. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Letter N. Okay, Ragani. So well done. Congrats. And let's uh, do. Um, let's go to the last one, Jivan. Let's see, Jivan. Have you done it before this exercise? Uh, sorry, Patricia. This is my first time. 
No, no. All right, it's your first time. Okay, so let's get you an easy one. Yeah, that is no easy one. <laughs> I'm sorry, there's no easy one. They're all difficult. But let's give you the letter I for Italy, okay? So think as many words as you can, starting in three, two, one, go. Uh, that's uh, iron in the air, uh, inhaler, institution, in Dixon, insect, uh, like uh, 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 Iran, uh, Italy, uh, Indonesia, uh, 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 Italy already, uh, Idol, Insium, Isiverg, uh, Image, uh, uh, <laughs> Infinite, uh, in the um, in title, Inside, Is, Idol, Iceberg, Indian. And your time is up. Oh my goodness. Well done for the first time. <laughs> so that, there were some words that I couldn't understand and some more repetitions. For example, India and Indian, we're counting as one. Um, but well done. It's so funny. It's, uh, many people from India, when I give them the letter I, they forget India. They never say India. <laughs> now it's fine. It's so curious. But you did it well. Um, there was one word you said, entitle, entitled. Is that what you said? I'm not sure. Uh, yeah. Entitled. Entitled. In, 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 and then you said is and it's. Yeah, I yes, I yes, is. <laughs> I is uh, and I, I'm gonna count as yeah, I'm gonna yeah, count as one. Ideas. Yeah. No, ideas I counted. Okay. So in, my final score then would be 19 words per minute. Uh what about you, Regani? How many did you count? Uh it's same with me, Patricia. 19 words. 19, right. So that's your final yeah. score, Jivan. Well done. Really well done. Yeah. That was am amazing. Yeah. So, guys, that's it for today. I'm 13 minutes late for another appointment that I have to run. Thank you so much. I will uh, let you know. Well, if you are uh, following the YouTube channel with the notifications on, you should be able to receive a notification as soon as we publish the video. And then you can watch and uh, listen to yourself and count it again and leave your comments if you have any. Okay. Thank you for joining us today. I look forward to seeing you all last week let's unmute everybody on the stage and let's give a big clap to hashita she's the winner of this week and we're gonna be give her a big shout out well done hashita well done darling congratulations well done bye bye everybody see you next saturday bye have a wonderful weekend Thank you! Bye -bye. Bye -bye.